Okay, everybody. Today, we're going to be driving through Whitestone and Malva, Queens, New York. Um, Whitestone's a little more middle class. And then, wow, lady. That was, that was interesting. <laughs> Whitestone's a little more middle class. And then when you get to Malva, it's a little more upper middle class and just the houses get up to around six million dollars so that says it all right there so yeah a little bit of history on Whitestone um, it's called Whitestone because it's built on white limestone so stones white pretty simple Whitestone um, Francis Lewis had a an estate here he was one of the signers of the Declaration of Independence in the Revolutionary War the English raided his estate, took his wife prisoner, he wasn't there, and they burned the estate down. So yeah, not, not too fortunate, his estate isn't here anymore. Um, in the 20s, Malva and Whitestone was mostly farm and woodland, and they uh, started knocking everything down and building mansions. So yeah, around this area is in mansions, but we'll get to that, don't worry. Um, and then development started going crazy in the in the late 30s when they built the Whitestone Bridge. At the time, the fourth longest bridge. What is going on here? At the time, the fourth longest bridge in the world, at 2,300 feet long. I don't think it's anywhere close to one of the longest bridges in the world now, to be honest. But it's still a cool bridge. And um, yeah, so. We'll be going to Malibu also. Oh, this is an old restaurant. I read something about that. Didn't read enough about it and tell you about it, but it's an old restaurant, the Clinton. Look it up. Yeah, the demographic in the area is mostly European, Greek, Irish, Italian, Jewish. Um, there is a small population of Asians. It's a growing community here. We're getting closer and closer to the water, so the houses are going to start getting bigger. We're actually in the neighboring town from College Point, Queens, one of my most recent videos. We're a little bit more uh, east. Some, some famous people that have grown up here or were born here. I just like this name. I don't really know much about him, but Fatty Arbuckle. I guess. I've heard it before, but I don't. I think he was an actor. And then uh, John Cena, the wrestler, was uh, born here. And Charlie Chaplin. Everyone kind of knows who Charlie Chaplin is. So, yeah, let's shoot around. Careful of landscapes, they can't hear when you're coming because they're running their equipment. I always go slow by them. Do you see this block right here? Wow. This is a dead end, but we're going to go down it.
this Maserati in the driveway. Even though these houses aren't the biggest or the most beautiful, they're still going for two million plus, three million dollars. And we're not even into the crazy, crazy part yet. I mean, these houses are crazy right here. Look at the sculptures. You got lions, kids playing on a seesaw, and kids playing on a log. Just regular sculptures to have, you know? Get a really good view here of the water. No trespassing, private property. Yeah, we are gonna get a nice view. That right there is a Throgs Neck Bridge, if you could see in the distance. That's over, that's the Bronx right across there. I've actually done a video over there. That's um, Silver Beach Gardens right across. Such a beautiful view out of the backyards of these houses. Alright, now we're gonna head to Malibu. Whoa! Alright, let's pretend we live here for a second. I did this in the last video, I might start doing more. We're just going to pretend like we're supposed to be here for a second. That view is crazy. Alright, time to get out before someone bothers us. Look at that outdoor kitchen. That's a fireplace. I'm sorry, well, an oven and a grill and smokestacks and everything. This is a little tight here for my big truck. I don't know if you guys know what I drive, but I'm driving around in a 2002 Ford F-250 pickup truck, four door, a long bed. So it's like the longest truck you could buy. That's not like ridiculous. Obviously you could buy a flatbed truck or a commercial vehicle, but There's a Toyota Supra in that guy's driveway. That's a rare car. If you guys know much about the car world. Here's a trick to go on over speed bumps. You put two tires on the flat side, it's a much smoother bump. It's less harsh on your car too. All 
All right, we're gonna cross under the white stone bridge. Look at these houses. Always pillars and crazy architecture and statues and just, that's a cool view. I wish I could aim the truck that way. Malba got its name is um all the founders of the Malba Land Company, all their last names. It's uh, Maycock, Alling, Lewis, Bishop, and Avis. That spells out Malba. I'm gonna let this person behind me pass. I'm pretty sure they're annoyed with how slow I'm going. Now we're in the area of like the six million dollar houses. crazy because you have these beautiful houses and right above you should be able to see right here it's a white stone bridge one of the busiest bridges around crazy you can see all the roofs of these houses going over all the properties look at this getting built look at this to the left okay everybody we're down this because you get a beautiful view we're all about nice views over here. That's a lot of the reason why these houses are so expensive. So right now we're sticking out. There's water on both sides. See everyone's taking pictures. It's just a nice area. This guy's breaking the rules. He's not supposed to be parking here. Sorry to interrupt your photo shoot, guys. Look at this back balcony. Crazy. Alright, now we're heading south.
The houses that you wouldn't even look twice at here, because everything's so crazy, are the most beautiful houses in any other neighborhood. If you get what I'm saying. Oh, another nice view. This is out the front windows to get this view. Wow. Oh, wow. Go around this loop. There's always construction. Wow, you don't have to back up for that one. That was pretty crazy. Not even finished yet. But just wow. Fountain in the middle. I can even keep going, but I don't want to run this video too long. So I hope you guys enjoyed. That was White Stone at Malba, Queens, New York. All right, have a good one.